If only you knew. If only you really knew. And that that's the Kiki Wyatt rendition. But if only you really knew how many times I've had the honors of uh, having this amazing lady right in studio with me with Aww. children. With children. But she is back with us tonight. Yes, Miss <laughs> Kiki Wyatt is with us on the love line tonight. Look, one of the most, in my personal opinion, and this is not to super head up, but she is probably the most underrated singer that hasn't gotten the fullest exposure that I would like to see her get. But she, it's starting to come around in a great way. But hell of a songwriter, uh, 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 a phenomenal, phenomenal, amazing mom. <laughs> and we're going to get the count in just a moment of how many children she is the mom of. And um, just a great dear friend who always keeps it real. And I just love her to pieces. Miss Kiki Wyatt. Thanks for coming in. It's been so long since you've been on the quiet storm, but how in the hell have you been? Sure having babies, child. <laughs> <laughs> so the baby count right now is what? Eleven. Do are you you're not related to Nick Cannon, right? I'm just saying, I mean, because I think he has he got hold on. He's having them with baby mamas. They mine are coming out of my body, honey. <laughs> so I, I get can't it. stand when a man's like Oh, I got such and such, and I, yeah, but you didn't have to have them. I had mine. Well, yeah, I got you. Yeah. I got you. Well, you know, yeah. the, but 11, are, are we stopping at 11 or do you need to go a couple more? What's your ultimate goal of children? Well, uh, my business ain't shut down. So, <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, if it ain't shut down, then who knows what's Wow, on? Kiki, no, Kiki. No. So wait, help because I don't think I've ever asked you this. Do you come from a large family? Like you have a lot of siblings? And if so, how many? I, I don't I have four brothers, but my great grandparents at 18, my grandparents at 12. Yeah, yeah. So I come from a big family. So when we go to our family reunions, honey, <laughs> somebody's always coming back with a new baby. <laughs> I swear, it's like, <laughs> oh my like, gosh, who is, that? who is that? So wait, yeah. what does mama, what does your mom say about, you know, the children? Are she, is she inquiring? Like, um, she loves it. The only doesn't... thing is she worries about me because she's like, girl, stop having all these babies, your body, your body, your body. I'm like, mama, it's my body, my body, my but, body. But, you know, look, see, life re repeats itself. You know that, right? So you have daughters. Yes. Yes. I so, think I know which daughter is probably going to do the kiki. And that's, <laughs> that's Kiyoshi Bella. I think Bella Kiyoshi. is going to be a mother of many. I think when you came to the studio last, you had the baby was in the carriage. And I think it was the boy. Am I wrong? I got three little boys now. Three what's younger the, boys. What's the youngest? So he's one. Okay, it wasn't that one. <laughs> but then, right. And then Kiriah's three and Kendall's five. So maybe it was Kendall. Kendall. Yeah. It may have been it Kendall. Was Kendall. Yeah. And hey, look, you know, I, I commend you for being such a dynamic mom and you know, for you wanting a large family. You but I don't know how you balance that with your life, you know, because your life is not exactly you know, smooth sailing because you're dealing with a lot. But it's but it's it's not hard though. I mean, I don't know why people hear eleven kids and they just think, oh my God. It's just it's really not it's not like that. It's really not. Um everybody has their own personality. Everybody is their own person. It's just family. <laughs> it's no, really. And, it's and, not like people think. Not to me, anyway. Or to my okay. husband. So, right, we, right. we be chilling. We be chilling. Everybody blended. got problems. Not us. Not no, I hear. <laughs> well, blended family is definitely at the, that's the title. You definitely are the crescendo when it comes to blended family, for sure. Thank you. Kiki White is with <laughs> us tonight. Uh, tomorrow night on We TV, you kick off. Uh, this interesting reality show, you're letting the cameras come into your personal home so we all can see what yep. really is going on. Despite of what you're telling me right now, and I yep. saw the highlights, and I could I didn't know you would uh, you that much of a diva, huh? I'm really not though. That's why um, if you think I look like a diva, I no, I don't think you look like a diva. I mean, do you have diva-ish? 
that's what I'm saying. If you think I, I appear as a diva, then maybe I am a diva. Hell, I don't know. Am I a diva, bro? Yeah. I'm a diva. <laughs> we got a diva. We, hey, look, when two or more people agree, ladies and gentlemen, you have to pay attention. Diva. You are down. You are down to earth. You're one of the most beautiful down to earth women I know, and that well, is hell, I amazing. Mean, that's where I live. I hope I. Am. <laughs> <laughs> I won't be nowhere else. Honey, unless I'm going to have on. I want to play a song uh, with you, my boy okay. Avant, if you don't mind. Um, which one? My first love, or you and I? Mm. You and I. Let's do that. She's with me tonight. Kiki Wires inside of the Quiet Storm. Believe it or not, she's back. It's been a long time, but it's so good to see the sister. Welcome inside the Quiet Storm. Here. It's soft, it's warm, it's sexy, it's right, and it's right on many levels tonight because this wonderful, dynamic songstress uh, who we have loved and cherished her voice. You know, you I know she has a church background. Because you, you you sing with 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 the depth of of that Holy Spirit in you, Kiki Wyatt is with us, and um, you have not ventured and did, uh, if I'm not mistaken, a a gospel album, full gospel album yet, right? No, I haven't, but I am because, um, you know, I'll, well, I'll call it an inspirational album. Yeah. So, but I have not done one, but I am going to do one. Um, Oh, you hear the baby in the background? I, I hear it. He is it's, cracking up. It is nothing foreign to us here on the choir storm. <laughs> when, when Kiki Y comes, you you bring the children, you bring the family. I'm going to bring my babies with me. And I we get a chance to meet your entire family tomorrow night. Uh, well, it starts tomorrow night. And it will be on every week on We TV Network, Kiki Wyatt's World. <laughs> so cute. So cute. <laughs> he's busted. I think him see feet. Oh, oh no doubt. <laughs> but um, yes, it's never a dull moment. No, <laughs> no, not at all. I cannot wait for the show to come and my new album. Um, it's gonna be amazing. Um, because I'm finally doing music after six years of waiting and being depressed and being, you know, with postpartum and different things and just life circumstances and losing both my grandparents within three months of each other back to back. And, yeah. um, <clears throat> you know, and going through, you know, the ups and downs, the highs and the lows with my baby, like he's special needs. Right. Um, he don't look special needs, but no. you know, we have, uh, you know, things going on. But this music, I feel it's just, because it's coming from such a deep place in my heart and a deep place in my mind um, to be free from, you know, all the stresses of life in the world. I feel like it's, I feel like it's gonna be able to help a lot of people and like I tell people all the time, music can change your mood, honey. So yeah. if you're sad, just turn on some good music and you just bump out and ride out and be happy. And, you know, and I feel like that's what my album is going to do. If you want to feel sexy and, you know, <laughs> be smackalicious for your man, go on, be smackalicious for your man with a song, you know. Or if you want to, you know, try to tell your man, yo, get off that video game. I'm sick of that video game. You mm. know, I got a song for that. I got a, you know, a clap back. So I got all of it. So I think this album is going to be really good. I'm just so amazed. And, and we should talk about your husband. Your husband is a stay at home dad. Yes. He now, it, he, he's got to have the patience of life. Now, wait, does he have prior oh, children? Oh, he does. He does. He has but, prior children as well? No. No. Oh. He does not. So this man is crazy. <laughs> if you ask me. He's coming into a lot. Baby. What? He, was single, he was single for seven years, celibate for six, 
and kept asking the Lord for a family, and the Lord gave him oh, overflow. He gave, <laughs> baby, that's like you having nothing, and you be like, Lord, I want, and then he give you all this. You be like, I didn't ask for all that, but all right, Jesus. Be careful what you ask for. That's right. You ask them, you shall receive. And you never know how the Lord is going to work. I, I think the Lord laughs a lot. He's like, I'm going to give everyone a joke. He's, he has a chemistry. And he so does. I want to get into the first single. Talk, Tell me okay. about the first song. How did how, you wrote everything on this, on this album, I'm assuming? Or yes, most of well, it. and with, you know, partners as well. But uh, for the most part, it's all my words. I'll say what I'm going through and we make a song out of it, literally. Um, but my uh, single that's out right now is called Water Into Wine. And we'll I'll get some water and wine. <laughs> that's how, that has an inspirational title-ish to it, you know, turn yeah. water into wine. Yeah. Wow. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to drop that. Jesus do it? All the time, every time. Mm -hmm. Kiki Wyatt is with us tonight. I'm going to let her go because she has her hands full literally tonight. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to let her do what she has to do. But I, I want to drop this song first. But don't forget, tomorrow night uh, on the Weed Network, you can catch yeah. out Kiki Wyatt's world. And we're going to see how interesting her world has been uh, in, in just a little while, in a few hours. So make sure that you watch it. And if you don't miss it, if you miss it on Weed TV, I understand that they can catch it on the BLK, All Black. The All Black. Yep. All so Black. on Mondays. So yep. it's... Uh, it's not a long, it's not like a 13 uh, episode thing. It's a six, it's a six week thing, right? Yeah. We just, you know, seeing how people like it and, you know, and then I'm like, <laughs> do I really want to continue this? <laughs> so, you know, we just playing around with it. So if y'all like it, let me know and then we'll do more. Let's get into water. No. Water into wine or wine into water? Water into wine. Kick your wife uh, of the quiet start. storm. Water into wine, people. <laughs> the quiet storm in full effect. And uh, wine is what we're sipping on, but uh, Water into Wine is her new single off of the forthcoming album. When is the album going to be complete? Or, and are you doing album, an album, a full album? Because yeah, I speak to so many, because so many, so many, so many R&B artists these days are saying, I don't know if I'm going to put out a whole album. A lot of, some of them are putting out EPs. Where, where's your heart in that? Um, it's only like ten songs, probably. I don't know, but um, I got like one song left to do, and then I think I'm probably going to release it on Shiny Key Records, um, probably the beginning of the year. So right. we're just gonna have to see. But you know, I see why artists be like, "Oh, honey," because. <laughs> No, for real. And the stuff be getting expensive and just but different the, things. So. But Kiki, the, the process is different these days, not unless you, you're you bringing in full band on these on this album or you're doing it in a different kind of way. Oh, no, honey. This is about to be big, bigger than life. Wow. So mm -hmm. it's like go all or go home. I'm you interested. Know, in, you know? I'm interested to really learn more about what we're going to see without you giving away all the cookies and cream. But I, I'm I'm curious to know how your life is. You know, we only get a chance to kind of talk and, and sit down with you, of course, when the new record is coming out. So it's going to be really interesting to see how your life, a day in the life of you, is like you said a little while ago, is never a dull moment. Never. And, and, it, and it's kind of exciting. But but look, and don't take this personal, I think everyone is a little cray-cray. So how how well, cray, -cray? I know I'm cray cray, <laughs> but in a good way. I'm not crazy bad. I'm crazy good. You're crazy good. Don't push me crazy bad, but anybody can be pushed crazy bad. Yep. On that trailer, you you seem to have pushed your road manager uh, crazy bad. But you say now that he pushed me crazy. Bad, <laughs> I say, you look here. You bit back. Look, you just just watch, just watch. I will, I will. But but I'm curious to know. I always got my reasons for for my clowning. Where where do you want to take your career at this stage of the game? What, what direction do you want to take your career in at this stage of the game? Wherever the Lord takes it. I don't mm. mind. I just want his will to be done in my life and my children and my husband and my family. You know, and whatever he does is going to work out for me and for them and us. And we're okay with that. But I know that, you know, the main thing is ministry. And... um 
this is a hell of a way <laughs> to do ministry, but, <laughs> you know, I mean, you know, for me, I'm the type of person that don't preach to me if you ain't been through nothing. Mm. So, you know, I feel like I'm going through so that when it's time for me to preach something, I got something to preach about. Well, 11 kids, children in uh, different levels of your life, dealing with different relationships. I think you have a lot to definitely preach, preach and, and teach. <laughs> yes. um, now, the question is, are will people listen? You know, because you they can tell. I think they absolutely will, because, you know, um, everybody's looking for something and that something is Jesus Christ. So, you know, and I know him for sure. And I can definitely help you find him if you want to find him. Wow. OK, that was a pow that's a powerful <laughs> statement. Look, yes. uh, you got your hands full tonight and you were so <laughs> kind to just take out some time to hang out with me. I appreciate that. Well, you know, I love you, Lenny. I love you too, Miss Kiki. I love you like a whole bunch of grapefruit and everything else that comes Ooh, along with it. Yes, yes, yes ma'am. I can't wait to see your dumb performance. I don't think, and I know this is going to sound crazy. I don't think I've ever seen you live in performance. So yeah. I'm nope. What so is I, with you, Lenny? Well, you know, you don't never really know. I don't know your schedule like that. So well, that's true. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep a track uh, of how you're moving. So I'm, I'm sure with this new album coming out, oh, maybe yeah. we get. Honey, I'll be everywhere. I've already yeah. been everywhere without an album for six years. <laughs> so imagine with an album. So you're going to catch me. You're going to catch me. And so. I opened up tonight with uh, your rendition of Patti LaBelle. How um, special is she to you? Very. I love that lady so much. I can't believe. I still can't believe she called me and was like, look here, help her. <laughs> she, I said, she did. She was like, I can never sing my song again because of you. She was like, but I love it and I love you. And I was like, oh my God. So now when I sing that song, I really, I sing it with passion and you know what I mean? It's crazy. You sing everything with passion. Are you kidding well, me? Thank you. But I feel like she blessed that song. I and you bless it on, on top of her blessing. So it's a double well, blessing on the song. No question. Well, thank you. You're making it hard for her, though. I, I understand why she's saying that. Because, like, you know, Patty is blessed to oh, have no, that no, range. No, no, honey. Patty's still Patty now. You can't <laughs> take Patty from Patty. You, you cannot. Can't, you, you cannot. cannot. Take Patty and you can't take Patty. Kiki from Kiki White. That's for sure. Well, thank you. I love you. Be yeah, well. I'll you. see you soon. You Don't too. forget, tomorrow night. Have your eyes glued on We TV, and you're just going to see episode one. So you can imagine whatever goes down on episode one, and they haven't proved me to see it beforehand. So I'm going to be just as surprised, mouth jaw open, and scratching my <laughs> head like you will, ladies and gentlemen. But we got to watch this lady because I'm curious to see how your life is outside of you coming to a radio station to sit down with me. Ooh, have fun, honey. Just some popcorn and a good old cocktail. <laughs> I'm gonna get the cocktail first, though, for sure. <laughs> yes. Kiki, take it easy, baby. All right, you too, sugar.